So the Supreme Court comes out and says, we will hear the case about Donald Trump's absolute immunity and sets up arguments for April 22nd. A lot of people are excited about this. They're nervous about that. And before you get too excited, I want you to just stop and think, and let's look at this logically. First of all, regarding the Supreme Court, they've revealed who they are. They're willing to delay or Donald Trump. They are complicit with Donald Trump. That goes without saying. They waited two weeks to come out with this answer, and they're going to make us wait seven weeks to hear arguments. They did the 14th Amendment thing within a few days. They had the capability of doing this faster, but they chose not to. So they are all about delaying this for Donald Trump. Now, People are freaking out about this. Oh, my God, it'll go past the election. And then we got Georgia and then we've got Florida. And everybody's really upset and excited about this. But you have to look at this with some logic and some common sense and take the emotion out of it. What else is going to happen between now and April when these arguments are going to take place? Well, in the next three weeks, Donald Trump clearly can't come up with the money so his properties are going to be liquidated and he's going to be broke as a motherfucking joke. He's going to have no money and he's running for president. But don't forget, everybody seems to forget, on March 25th, Donald Trump will be going to trial. He's being charged with 34 felonies. 34 felonies. You think he's going to run the table on that? You think he's not going to get convicted of some, if not all, of those felony charges? Well, of course he is. And when that happens, when his money's gone and he gets several felony convictions, the motherfucker's done. I mean, how many times do you got to swat a fly before it's dead? The other court cases will come. They can come before or after. I don't really fucking care. It's this first court case that's going to do Donald Trump in, along with the fact that they're going to take everything he owns away from him. Oh, and the last part, there is no way, zero way for Donald Trump to win. The only way this strategy of delay for Donald Trump works is if he wins the election. And if you're honest with yourself and you look at this, there is no pathway for Donald Trump to win the presidency. Donald Trump is done no matter what happens, when it happens, how it happens. He's fucking done. And between now and March 25th, there's going to be a whole lot of fucking trouble for Don and this Supreme Court argument hearing isn't even important compared to what's coming up in the coming two to three weeks.